Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and welcome back to my Maple Syrup Empire. I've been slowly losing my mind in this game, but you didn't have to deal with that because, well, I'm not gonna freaking upload episodes of me just chopping wood, losing my mind, making maple syrup, trying to get freaking power from my stupid little shack over there. But yes, as you can see at the top left corner, uh, I've been slowly grinding away at the whole money thing. I think I needed like 28K. Um, it's Friday now, so it's my final day to uh, sell some more maple syrup. Don't know if we'll get it this week, but we are very, very close to finally getting on the power grid. Should I wait for this barrel? Probably. But yes, honestly, I've been just kind of sitting here uh, as I'm editing other videos, just kind of just dealing with maple syrup. I haven't done really anything with friendships. Haven't done anything else. I mean, I've been keeping up with my farm a little bit because that's so easy. But aside from that, you haven't missed much. I uh, did add a few more trees to the system because as you can see, I'm so efficient now. I'm sucking sap out, but my system can't keep up with me right now. So yeah, I've been really focused on this power grid as you've probably heard. I should really turn this off. And if not in this episode, the next episode, we should be able to finally not have to deal with power anymore. And my God, is that ever an amazing thing? Next goal will be obviously to get this upgraded because dealing with wood now is a nightmare. Thankfully, as you can see, I've been kind of bringing trees closer together. And yes, as I've been just sitting here doing nothing, I have a big backlog of wood right now. So it's not too much of an issue. Uh, but yeah, I haven't done anything on the car yet. I'm really hoping to uh, put that thing together today to try and do some of the night racing. Also, I think we should get the racetrack unlocked today. Uh, we were really close last episode. Again, I haven't dealt with friendships at all, so... Uh, we should be close to that. As you can see, my farm, eh, it's not doing the best. I haven't been very committed to it, but uh, I just did get a weed harvest. So uh, I guess I could try and uh, refine that. And look at that. We have two packs now. I haven't sold the other pack either. Is that three packs? Whoa, easy now, tiger. And four packs. Okay, I didn't actually expect to have this much weed. Um, so there is a goal to give my friends some weed. So we might do that. <laughs> I still haven't actually used any of this. Yes, this is actually great. We actually might be able to sell this for a profit. I don't know. Uh, actually, he here's the note so we can see how much we need. Damn it. Why did I think it was 27K? So it's 29K. Again, uh, I really haven't been that efficient. So I'm probably only going to get a grand or two uh, this Sunday. So that will be probably next episode. I really wanted to work on the car today anyways. And we will do that once I sell the, the last of my maple syrup. Because you got to remember, it's closed during the weekend. So I want to get it sold as quickly as possible. I should mention the only friendship I accidentally maxed out was the gas station owner, and all he gives me is I can get gas even if it's closed, which is really convenient, actually, because there's been many times where I've been here a little bit too late and haven't been able to get gas. So that's all I've unlocked since last episode. Okay, in the place I've been to way too often lately, there we go. Sunday couldn't come any quicker. I, I Again, I haven't been too efficient, so I don't think I'll do too well. But we should at least get 27 grand, and then we're just really close to the next one, so I don't have to focus so much on damn maple syrup. I'm losing my mind on maple syrup, if you haven't been able to tell. Anyways, let's get back home and uh, start working on this car. I would like to go to the... Uh, Nighttime races tonight, if I can get the thing actually in working order, because right now there's no wheels on it. Okay, so I have no idea what I'm doing here, but uh, we have a transmission that I know is part of my to-do list, so I would like to try and at least install that. Uh, plus, just having a manual makes more sense if we're racing with it. Also, the coilovers I need to install. I think this is probably the only thing I need to take out to get to that, possibly. I am definitely not a mechanic, so I have no idea if I'm doing this right or not. You know what? I'm just going to take it all apart because that seems fun. All right. Well, I sat in the car and that's a good sign. Um, there's a blown shock here. Hold on. <laughs> yep. Okay. I mean, I am not the sharpest. Is it, are these for the back or is this for the front? Okay. It is for the front. Look at that. I know what I'm doing. So we can get rid of the blown one. Now we have some actual suspension in this bad boy. I think everything else, I mean, I do need a new blade. Should I go buy a brake rotor? No, I'm going to spend so much money if I need everything perfect. Let's just get this thing back together. It was drivable. Let's remember that. Oh my God, you can adjust the tow angle. I don't know what I'm doing enough to do this. So let's just keep it at 50. This is definitely over my head. So I'm going to do my best to do this right. 
<laughs> and hope for the best. Okay, everything's going back together. That's a good sign. Brakes, get on, please. Thank you. I have lost my wrench already. Where the hell did my wrench... All right, well, you know what? We have this here. We may as well use it. Oh, I hate that it doesn't show where all the bolts are. I guarantee you I'm going to miss a bolt. I, I might even miss a whole piece here. This is what I was looking forward to, but I was really scared about because... Yeah, I, I I am not a mechanic at all. I mean, we could throw a tire on and, and hope for the best and see what happens. It goes on. That's a good sign, right? Let's just get in here and make sure everything is good. You can adjust toe angle. Lots of rusty parts. Again, most of this I can actually change too, but I'm just more excited about getting this car back together for the time being. Uh, so we'll do the same thing on the other side. Install the coil over here and... Uh, I guess put on the tires because I think the backs are pretty much done besides the wheel hubs. Like, isn't this supposed to be in that? Oh, am I, am I really screwing up? Oh, you can adjust the height. This is so cool that you have to, like, get in there. Looks like you can even adjust bump force. I don't know what any of this means. We're just going to keep it stock for the time being. All right, this is taking way longer than expected, but I have it in... Well, I don't have it installed. I have it placed. Now, really? Is there, is there, is there freaking lights in here? There we go. Who cares if it's nighttime when you got lights? I'm just wasting gas doing this, though. Ah, oh, that's what I'm missing. A whole freaking brake rotor there. Wait, is the other side of the brake rotor on? Oh, God, I don't think it does. I have to say, if I never played Car Mechanic Simulator, I would be screwed right now. I at least feel like I'm getting somewhere because I don't have any bolts left. It's a good sign when you don't have any extra bolts left over. Oh, God damn it! stop scaring me. This side does have one bolt left, so that tells me that possibly... Are we missing a brake rotor over here? Well, we'll be able to find out when we pull out and there's a brake rotor on the ground, I guess. All right, I don't care if it's missing a piece. It's almost 12 at night now, so I just want to get out and see if we can race. As long as it moves, I'm taking it out, damn it. We have upgrades on it. That's the important part. And we'll worry about the rest of these upgrades later because I am... No, prepare. I didn't even know I had rear ones. I have to say, this thing's really nice, but it's annoying that the impact gun constantly teleports back when you're not using it. Okay, like I just forgot to put the tire on. Now I need to go back and grab it again. Uh. Are you serious? I was so focused on upgrading, I forgot to eat. Damn it! Well, I guess we're not racing tonight, are we? Thank God, uh, you, death isn't permadeath in this game. I just have this weird 88 second thing where I'm in slow motion. Because I hit my head, I guess. Well, I don't need to go fast anyways. <laughs> God damn it, I just put it all together though. And now it's morning time, so I could put more things on. I just want to make sure it's working first though. Oh God, why is there an extra bolt? There's always one extra one just staring at me. I don't think this went well. I'm, I'm only... I think I only have two extra bolts, though. That's that that's pretty good if I do say so myself. <gasps> it's working! It's even doing semi-burnouts. Okay. Well, that was stressful to say the least. What am I missing here? Okay. I think that's the old caliper, because we upgraded the back one, so we don't have to worry about that. This is why organization is key. Um, Wait. We ha uh oh oh wait did I get new calipers in the front I don't think I did did I nope I think I forgot my caliper and wait I may maybe did I forget calipers on both sides so I have only rear braking right now I'm smart yes my genius knows no boundaries I did forget my calipers <laughs> let's also paint this bad boy I guess that doesn't get rid of the rust now, does it? It just looks extra bad now. And I totally forgot to deal with maple syrup today. This is the problem with this game. There's only so many things you can focus on. And, uh, yeah, I kind of focused on the car. But it's running now, so that's good. I guess for the rest of today until tonight, uh, I'll just work on maple syrup. And, yeah, anything else that we kind of need to do on a day-to-day -day basis like this. All right, it's 3 o'clock now. It's pretty much too cold to pull out any more maple syrup, so I'm going to call it a day. Uh, did some more tree chopping, as you can see. I think we'll be okay for wood for a while. We actually did pretty good. It was way up here, and it, we, we brought it back down. I got one barrel, uh, one, one and a half barrels here, and that looks like we're going to melt a little bit more as we get out of here. All right, so what I'm going to do is uh, save the game. That takes a couple hours of in-game time, so uh, kind of convenient because we need to get out there, I think, at 12? And hopefully by the time I wake up from this, my gaming session, if you will, 
we can go finally race in this game you know do the whole point of this game after what like eight episodes of me essentially dealing with maple syrup <laughs> See if this thing can even stay together. I'm really scared that I royally screwed this up. Oh, God. I'm sorry, truck. Oh, there's my freaking wrench. It was inside the car. All right. Well, at least I know where that is now. What is going on? I'm just trying to pull out, truck. Please don't destroy it. Oh, this is a bad sign. I am... It's making weird noises. I'm hardly moving. It's got lights on. I don't think it's all together, guys. But hey, let's just get it on the road and see if it gets better. Dude, it's sliding all over. Like, look at this. It's sliding so much. It's hardly even staying in gear. Oh my god. What did I do wrong? Yeah, I I can't race this. I can't even go fast. And look at this. It's sliding all the time. Yeah, French slur indeed. All right, hold on. Now, now that we're on this, this is not any better. It was, it was faster stock. There's something definitely wrong here. Oh my god. 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 Okay. I hit the brakes. The brakes really work well. Everything else, not so freaking much. Can't even get up the hill. I, I, I might actually have to tow this thing. Wait, did I not pump up the tires? Is that the freaking problem? All right, let's just see. <laughs> what is going on? I mean, everything's together. I think it's just the tires aren't pumped. Yeah, I can't, I can't bring it up the hill, so we're gonna have to... Either work on it out here or tow it. I'll probably just tow it and do the drive of shame back to my place tomorrow. God damn it, man. Well, one exciting thing is I embarrassingly walk home. Look at that. It's payday. And oh my God, I'm so close. I didn't realize it'd actually be 3,000. That's one of my better paydays. Well, at least now we know if the whole car thing doesn't work out, I might be able to get on the power grid this episode. This is going off the rails quickly, but that's just Mon Bazoo in general. Oh, you know what? I actually have enough money. Should I? Yeah, I'm doing it. I've been waiting so long. How the hell do I sign this thing? Wait, no, I don't want to sit on it. I mean, that's kind of fun, though. I guess if I just put it in the mail, I'll, I'll automatically sign it. Thank you. Thank you. For, did, I, did I sign it? How the hell are you thanking me when I walk out? All right, I'm going to have no freaking money left, but I, I'm doing it. If, if we don't get the car set up... I, I want to be on the power grid by the end of this. I'm done dealing with freaking gas all the time. I almost forgot this. That would have pissed me off. All right, hold on. Before I waste money, actually, I can't even afford the tow truck if I was to get the power grid. So before that, let's see if we can just manhandle this thing. All right, throw her in the four-wheel drive, baby. We're going to need all the help we can get. And I put it in the wrong gear because I'm brilliant. There we go. Come on, just get it up there. Oh, my anxiety just went through the roof with that. It's okay. This is how you move cars, goddammit. Get it up there. Stop French slurring. It's okay. Everything's fine. I'm a professional. Oh, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Hopefully, I don't actually do damage because that would suck. It has to be flat tires. I, was, I thought the tires were just clipping into the ground. No, the, the, it's guaranteed that's my issue is I, I kept it on flats. So, easy fix. If we can get it freaking home. Oh, actually, hold on. No, big brain move. I have that, um, the, the small tire pump. All right, I'm just going to bring the tire pump here instead of spending all day trying to get this up the hill. I've never been so happy to see a wonderful Canada post office. Thank God. Now, I'm a little nervous because I'm so close to the budget. Uh, I don't think it takes the money right, right away, so I just got to make sure I have 29K all the time. Uh, but do I just put it in here? Do I have to, like, get a pen somewhere? There we go. Okay, it's gone. I did it. <gasps> I have $45. Okay, it took it out right away. That's that's good, actually, because I don't have to worry about my budget anymore. I have basically no money now. Fantastic. All right, please tell me this is my issue. It's a good sign when it's zero PSI. I'm only going to go to, like, 20. I know that isn't, well, maybe 30. We should be fine with 30, right? It's definitely working. You know what? I'm going to even go to 40. I'm feeling... I, there's no way a tire's going to blow until, like... I, I don't even know. Like, 60, 70? 40 was safe, and it looks like it has enough air to, you know, get home. And that's all I really care about right now. Okay, moment of truth. Did I fix all my problems in this episode? <laughs> this episode went from bad to really, really good if this car moves easily. I mean, we have grip, baby. We definitely have grip. I think I actually set this car up right, aside from the whole air pressure issue. Now I have the fun job of, uh, oh God, don't get stuck, don't. Don't get stuck! Oh, get it out, get it out, get it out. 
Oh, I hate, I hate myself. I hate. <laughs> Not one thing, it's another, man. I swear to God, I hate dealing with hoist pullers in this game because they never freaking work first try. Okay. And onward. See a truck? I'll get you in a second. Just see if this thing actually works. I feel like I screwed up the engine somehow. It's just, it's got very low revs. Oh, 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 oh. I don't like this car. Oh my God, did I just do that? I accidentally, I accidentally hit the forward button, not the reverse button. I'm gonna lose my skate. Get out of there. Stop dealing. Ah, oh, I'm so angry. I'm so freaking angry. No, don't, 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 don't. Oh, I forgot to put the freaking bar parking brake on. Okay, parking brake engaged. Oh. Make sure it's in reverse this time, not accidentally going forward like a derp. Get me the hell home. I mean, it wouldn't make sense. Whoa, whoa! Damn it! I hit the brakes and it goes to the right like crazy? Holy, this thing. I think I've ruined it with at with aftermarket parts. This thing, like, when I hit the brakes, look at it. That's just me hit hitting the brakes straight. Anyways, I think we'll pump the tires up a little bit more. That could be a dangerous thing, but I definitely want a little more air in it, I think. I mean, I don't know what a good PSI is, honestly. We're gonna go to 50. 50 should be good. Oh, this thing's so much better. Also, do we have uh, power yet? I don't know if it's... I, th I think it takes time, but actually... Nope, yeah, we don't have power yet. We still gotta wait. Oh, uh, yeah, doesn't that look like a sports car now? Are you not impressed? <laughs> Right now, I'm just gonna be tightening all these loose bolts that... There's the transmission. Okay, so I know I can easily change the transmission here. But yeah, there's loose bolts everywhere. So I'm just trying to do anything I can to help get any sort of hearse power out of this thing. Oh, you know what? Let's lighten the load. We, we, we can take out the passenger seat. Yeah, I, 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 don't, I don't have friends. I pull this out. There we go. Uh, yeah, that's so cool. I'm actually really impressed with the modding in this game. Like, seriously. There we go. Oh, I think I found an issue. I kind of forgot the front brake calipers as well. I'm smart. That might be why I'm going all over the place when I try and freaking brake. There we go. They're weak, but hey, they're better than nothing. That's probably why they fell off. I forgot to screw them on. I'm learning. All right, we need to go early because I kind of forgot I need to survive again. Only maple syrup I have is uh, in my truck, so I'm going to have to make a stop by there. I can actually kind of control this thing, too, so I feel like the PSI is right. You know what? Aside from the lacking engine and a little still squirrely brakes, I think we'll be okay. What the hell is that? <gasps> I think that's maple syrup. Ain't nothing like road maple syrup, baby. Hell yeah! I don't know where that came from, but I'll take it. Now I don't need to stop in my truck. Okay, chill out. Chill out. Are you serious? You can't do this to me. This is really stuck. This is really stuck. All right, hold on. I'm gonna try and just gas it through this. Nope. There we go. It's, it's rolling. It's rolling. It's rolling. Uh, that's a good sign. Get it away. Get it away. Get in. Just get in the car. Just get in. Come on. Come on. Come on. I don't care about noises. Just get me there. Okay. Crisis averted. Like the 15th crisis this episode. Oh, thank God. The street meet's still on. I can see them. Am I actually going to be able to race? Now, let's remember, kids. It's not about winning. It's just about having fun. Anthony! I would love to race tonight. Oh, my God. I need money. I need $5, Anthony. Ugh. I just want a street race. Why is life so hard? All right, let's just pretend last night didn't happen. I forgot, you know, it actually costs money to do this. So yeah, sold some logs today. Let's try this for what? The third time now? Fourth time? I, I, I forget at this point. Anthony, please, please let me race. Okay, here we go again. We're, we're going to get destroyed, guys. Here we go. Where am I going? Oh, he's not that he's not that much faster than me. Honestly, we might compete here. We might compete with the old sunburst. Oh god, it's gonna be fun with braking though. Okay, nice and slow. Slow and steady wins the race. Here we go, buddy. I can't believe I'm actually competing. We turn? Oh wait, is that, that is that it? I hit the brakes! 
I hit the brakes because I thought we would be turning. That's the easiest race I've ever seen. Screw you. I would have won that if I wouldn't have hit the brakes at the end. I seriously thought we'd be driving all around this place. I didn't expect to be a drag strip, essentially. Well, there's 50 bucks well spent, but at least I know maybe my car is okay. It's just it's very bad. Oh, and of course, the guy is here that buys freaking radios, and I didn't bring my radio with me. Anthony, can I, can I freaking race again, bro? Damn right I can. Uh, oh, never mind. Okay, well, at least we know what the racing's all about. Very, very basic. Unfortunately, I lost that one, but it's only because I was being extra cautious. All right, guys, I need a break. Honestly, I need a drink after this episode. Holy crap, everything that possibly went wrong did. But the important part is we have upgraded our car. We are now on the grid. We truly are getting to where this game is going to get really, really fun. I think I'm one or two friendship away from unlocking the racetrack as well. So now it's all about upgrades and uh, seeing how fast we can actually make this car. So yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying the adventure that is Mon Bazoo. And the next one, as I said, we'll hopefully be earning some money because of our uh, maple syrup operation. And now we can actually spend money without hoarding it like a freaking goblin. So yeah, I just want to thank you for your continued support, guys. I'm sorry this series hasn't been going up as much as uh, I'd like it to. It took me a week of grinding to get the power grid set up. So now that we got that dealt with... Uh, hopefully you can see some more episodes in the very near future. But yeah, as always, guys, thanks for watching and liking. And I'll see you in the next one.